What happens if your team is one rated in FC24 career mode? As you can see right here, Arsenal is looking a little bit different than usual. We have one rated attack, four rated midfield, and nine rated in defense. I mean, some of these players are just one rated, some of them are two rated. I'm not sure why it's so random. I went ahead and changed up the stats of every single player to just one. So as you can see here, Martin Odegaard, everything that you can be able to change is uh, just one. And yeah, we still have a couple of other players in this team that is in normal ratings. So we have to get rid of them. Nobody over the rating of uh, 12 is uh, welcome here at this uh, football club. So we're just going to get rid of the last couple of players. And as we can see now, the rest of this team is yeah, just having one rated stats in everything. So right now, I'm really excited to see what kind of objectives, what kind of expectations Arsenal is going to have in career mode. Obviously, I'm not going to be using the latest squads. We're going to be using the current ones. Play as the real manager, Mikel Arteta, and here we go. We actually have a £97 million transfer budget. And um, yeah, a lot of this youth development is high, continental success is high. So, yeah, it, it's important, guys, that we um, somehow turn this one around. I don't know how we're going to do it. I mean, we are in the Premier League with the worst rated team in the world. So, I, I don't know what's going to happen. I mean, surely the objectives cannot be that crazy. You know, it's probably just going to be survive in the league or something. Avoid relegation. They want me to reach the round of 16 stage. And they also want me to finish in a Champions League place within four seasons. I mean, Europa League reached the quarterfinal? What, what is going on there? Yeah, for some reason we're not in the Champions League. That's a little bit weird, but... I mean, still, quarterfinals? H have you seen my squad? I think my youth academy is glitched because this guy is 34 rated. Have you ever seen this low of a player in the youth academy? I, I, I didn't know... It could go that uh, that far down. That is unbelievable. And he's got the potential of uh, 62. I'm actually surprised they have a market value at all. As you can see, 80,000. 80,000 for literally all of these players. It's, it's the same. Uh, a good thing is that they're not getting that much rage. But that is still probably too much more than they deserve. You know, they're, they are useless. So... Yeah, I don't know how this is gonna go, guys. If we just get a victory or a draw, I think I'll celebrate it like we won the Champions League. Over the past week, you might have noticed that I've been using a few different football shirts in my videos, and you've been asking me, where can I get them? The answer is Best Soccer Store. Right now, you can get a 20% discount if you use my code SANDER7. And listen to this, if you also follow Best Soccer Store on TikTok, you leave a like on this video and comment down below, done. I'm gonna pick three winners because they wanted to do a giveaway. So in three days, I'm gonna pick three winners that can choose their own football kits from their website. All the links are in the description down below. Good luck. We are just going to be simulating until January. And we will see where we are in the league. Hopefully, we are not, uh, you know, sacked just yet. But, um, yeah, I I'm just um, hoping that we can pick up at least a point. But I'll be pretty surprised if we aren't bottom of the league. I'm actually very surprised that Spain even offered us a contract. But uh, as we can see here, guys, I mean, we are not doing so great. There's a lot of progress assessments uh, going on because we haven't exactly followed the objectives. We are uh, yeah, in the middle of the manager rating right here on the way to literally in the red zone and getting the sack. But uh, as we can see, the players as well, some of them are quite tired. Some of them are rested as well. But the big question is, where are we in the table? Come on, please tell me we have at least picked up a point. And as we can see, we are bottom, but we've actually won the game. And six draws is not that bad. I was expecting to lose every single one, so I wonder which game we actually won, though. Guys, I have the answer. As you can see, in the bottom left corner, we actually beat Sheffield United 2-0 at home. And we also beat Bode Glimt 3-2 away, so we actually had... A really good October, but obviously, guys, we are on the way to uh, getting the sack, so I don't know how we're going to be able to survive this. Maybe I, I should be allowed to make one signing to see if I could uh, save my job. If there is one position which needs to be strengthened, it is the goalkeeper. We cannot be having a one-rated keeper. 
and expect results. I mean, we have to start building from the back. This is the only signing I'm going to be allowed to make. And we have literally bought, you know, the highest rated keeper in the world. So maybe that could help us a little bit. But um, yeah, I, I, I would still be very surprised if we don't finish bottom of the table. Farmer, your time is uh, done for now. And in comes Courtois. I just noticed that we have a 72 rated player here. That is uh, not allowed at all. I don't know where he appeared from. Maybe he returned from loan, but yeah, we're just going to go ahead and release him and get rid of that problem. Wow, I also just noticed a few players is making progress. Look at this. Rob Holding is up two ratings. Kivior is up by one rating. And uh, let's, let's take a look at Erdegaard, up by three. So, I mean, the, the, they're starting to uh, make some improvements here. I mean, Erdegaard is in the middle of his uh, prime as well. So now we're going to be simulating until the end of the season and... As I said already, oh wow, one more day is, is, is what it took. I, I've never seen somebody get sacked while you are still in the orange zone. Whilst we have respected your complete freedom as regard a, a term contra- What? Notice that the value of Courtois' recent deal. Oh my god, I completely forgot about that. Courtois was, was too big of a signing. And it's gone ahead and completely ruined the dressing room. It's not really a big problem because we are just going to be taking over Sheffield United who is also in the Premier League. So still we're going to be simulating to the end of the season and finding out if Arsenal can make it out of the relegation zone or at least pick up a few more points. So let's see what happens. It is time to find out if Arsenal could survive in the Premier League with just a one rated team guys if they have done it that would be unbelievable let's go over to the standings and as we can see arsenal is uh, definitely gonna be in the relegation zone have they picked up any more points they've actually got two more victories uh 12 draws so obviously they end up last but 21 points i still think that's better than a few teams have literally got in real life and arsenal i mean for the last half of the season they had a good keeper at least but other than that, I mean, their players were not very high rated at all. So, uh, I actually expected them to do worse. But, yeah, obviously, not a big surprise that you get relegated. I wanted to try this one more time, but I was going to start with Courtois from day one and not in the middle of the season. Obviously, I ended up getting sacked eventually. I ended up joining Luton, and eventually I got sacked there as well. And then I found out that one of the clubs that offered me a new deal was actually Arsenal. That was the only Premier League club and after scrolling through like championship clubs they appeared so that was really random. That's the first time I've ever seen it but obviously in the end we actually ended on the same amount of points so even though you have a good keeper it does really matter. You know everyone else is still so low rated and we're gonna be losing basically every single game. Let's go for 3000 likes in this video and subscribe to the channel for more.